Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Muckle Lover, and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Red Flood, in which we're playing as everyone's favorite German nation, the German Socialist Republic. I also like Prussia, which I like Prussia. Or Austria, which I sometimes like Austria, or even Switzerland, but regardless, we're playing as the GSR. Today, Paul Levy, the chairman of the Council of the People's Commissars, has announced that he will not run for as a candidate for the next election. This announcement has shook up the political landscape of Germany. Not only is Lev a beloved public figure, but without him, the KPD has a chance to lose the next election. The Politburo has already announced that a new candidate has been chosen, but uh, an NMAP, D, or USPD government doesn't seem this far away anymore. Thank you for everything, Comrade Levy. And what you're doing in the 1936 Reichsrat Congress. The Reichsrat Congress is the most important political power in Germany, consisting of representatives from all over Germany. This entity can propose and deny laws and elections and disband both the Central Rat as well as the Rat der Volkskommissar. Very cool. And right now we're trying to train a lot of our guys and we're just using up a whole bunch of fuel. But here are national spirits. Not very good for force isolation. But we do have to talk about amending the schism. <clears throat> After the retirement of love, the Politburo <clears throat> has decided to choose Ernst Maia as a new candidate for the position of chairman of the Council of the People's Commissariars. Or com commissaries. While well, he has been or has a very impressive biography and great knowledge in all matters of politics, he lacks charisma and, of course, warmth. Thus, the vanguardist wing of the KPD decided to propose their own candidate, the Russian immigrant Lev Sedov, to stabilize the party. The a proposal was made by a number of influential communists to choose a new candidate to reunite the party. Heinrich Mann is already well known and has a lot of experience, he's obvious choice. Anna Segers is highly educated, ambitious, and dedicated to the revolution. Everyone knows Bertolt Brecht, the Red Poet. He should lead the party, which I've, I've, read, I've read some of his stuff before. It's pretty good. They should not interfere into the matters of the party. The decision of the Politburo stands. Um, I don't know which way. I, okay, so I've done Goebbels before, and I love that route. Goebbels was so much fun. Uh, the N map D has prevailed. The Righteous Faction seems like fun as well. Uh, praise Germania. I like that idea. We worship Aldona. Hmm, interesting. So, let's go with that one. I don't know, we'll see what happens. I'm, as you can tell from the thumbnail, you can tell who's on the thumbnail. I, at the time of this recording, I cannot, so we'll see what happens. I'm interested. I'm, I'm totally fine with whoever we choose, but we'll see. Just not Goebbels, just because as much as I love Goebbels, um, i got to try someone else. I really do. We're not going to have enough fuel. Look at all that. The Navy needs a lot. The Army needs a lot. The Air needs a lot. The Reichsrat Congress. Today, commerce from all over Germany have gathered in the Prussian House of Representatives in Berlin. Many important matters of economy, politics, and military were discussed, but on the fifth and last day of the Congress, the most important decision was made at all, who would lead Germany into the future. All parties had good speakers. The KPD spoke of revolution and progress, the USPD of the peace and freedom, and the NMAPD of unity and strength, but after everything they decided to choose, true defenders of Germany, the vanguard of the revolution, the USPD. I don't know. I want to see if we can go to this way. NMAPD. Cool. The NMAPD has won the elections. The National Mehrheitsarbeiters Pi, the Partei Deutschlands. Nice. So I apologize if, I, if this is not the way you want me to go. I just I want to try something different. I don't I don't really want to do uh, Goebbels again. Even though I would love to do Goebbels. Goebbels is so much fun. I love Goebbels. Anyways, Deutsche Gesellschaft der Forschung der Wissenschaft, the DGFW, formerly known as the Kaiser Wilhelm Gesellschaft, has a goal to further research and scientific development. By doing so in the society, we are able to promote it as a place of revolutionary science. And I forgot to do this again. Gosh darn it. We have some motorized guys, which kind of hurts me. Ooh, this is not bad. Proterischaft. Hundertschaft. Hundertschaft. Cool. We're going to allow these guys. I want to see if we can maybe use quite a few tanks. I'd like to use quite a few tanks. Integrate the trade union is not bad. We'll wait a little bit. Actually, get more weekly wars, but it wouldn't be too bad. Go load and mobilization if we can, because we're trying to build a lot of civvies for now. So, we'll see what happens. And actually, this should help us with fuel gain, too. Yeah. Well, maybe not that much. But yeah, we gotta get to create the ZK BMT. BM, BMT, yeah. So I'll do this one first. Get more research speed, which is really good. The Vox will not be bad either, but oh well. The N map D breaks up. There's been a huge rift in the N map D following the recent victory. The factions of the Vanguard Party, the right wing pagan socialists, and the left wing national communists weren't able to evenly split the positions of power between themselves. The FAL stemmed from the refusal of Comrade Joseph Goebbels to assign a single elected right N map D with an official within the new government. After a whole day of heated arguments, the executives of the N map D have announced the following course of action Dismiss the pagan revisionists? Oh, I'd love to do that one so badly again, but Comrade Goebbels has betrayed the Vanguard. Look at that flag. Ernst Graf zu Revolo. Uh, Vanguard Socialism. We love Vanguard Socialism here. 
But we love Joseph Goebbels even more. Oh, we can do either one. Um, militarized industry. Yeah, since we can go this way, centralized planet economy, we're probably going to go that way. I think it went this way last time too, but this one's not too bad either. But you can do this one with almost everybody, so I want to do the ones that we can't do with everybody, so this one. ZKBMT. The Central Construction Bureau for Military Te Technology oversees the development of new designs for weapons and military vehicles. This will make our research, of course, more effective. Which I did play as Japan here too before, yeah. And they lost in China, which is it's actually very difficult to play as Japan, but it is what it is. Let's have more breaks down the east. Oh, no! Oh, Austria broke up too. Oh, boy. Uh, I want to get more political power. Point, point one is not bad. It's not great. But, you know what? I'd rather get it than not. Oh, wow! Almost two a day. God dang. Forest isolation is not terrible. For that much extra pee-pee. We do lose 20 from the backward south, but... so oh well. Yeah. New Calabino. Ah. Very cool. And we're trying to blaze. Yay! Oh, we can't do this one. Arrgh. We need Volkswehr. God dang it. The Volkswehr is a shield that keeps the German people safe from imperialism and reactionary revanchism. If we let our guard down, we will be mauled by one of the many enemies of socialism. Now. Uh... Oh. Austrian Commune. Can we unite if we send you volunteers? We can send you a whole division. Well, let's see. What do these horse boys look like? They're pretty bad, I'll be honest. They're pretty bad, yeah. Slovenia, huh? Well, these guys are probably going to die, but... Eh, God dang it, whatever. You have the commies? Here? Maybe. We send one tank division there. Van Klug. Nice. How many uh, guys can we send over? Uh, 80, actually, not bad. 88 is pretty good, actually. Even though we have no fuel, but whatever. We can find some fuel. We can trade away for one to get one more thing of fuel. It's not bad. America loves us. They love socialism in America. Volkswagen, and then we'll do this one to get the one done as fast as possible. I do want to get the heavy advanced hold just because we could honestly really use it. Like, later on. I do want to make sure our ships are de pretty decent, so. Yeah, we got a lot to develop first before we get too far. Wow, this is a mess. Another mushroom you can vote. Revolt. Very cool. So, you guys are dying. Is there really any point for me to stay here? Japanese volunteers. Make sure you get the equipment that you need, the supplies that you need, too. Make sure you not sent them tanks in. Well, at least he didn't die. That was fast. Alright, so much PP. What are we going to get? Military factory construction speed. Yeah, yeah, definitely do that one. Or we'll just go up to partial mobilization. Yeah, we'll go up first one. Famine in Zelto, Russia. Very cool. Nice. There, we're on that one next. Uh, land for construction speed. Dorscht, Burscht. Red Thunder. I do want to get a lot of tanks. I want to maybe try to get more tanks in this campaign. I want to be very tanky. Experimental science. Oh, yeah, why not? Germany is a country of the thinkers. The country of Einstein, Planck, and Meintner. We're destined to go into unknown territories and find out things our ancestors needed gods to explain. Let's go get another one, too. Nice. We got that one done. Grab some extraction. Uh, let's grab some better artillery, maybe. Just keep learning, man. Keep learning. No, it's difficult, but keep going. Yeah, if you don't win quick as it commies, you're probably going to lose in, in Japan, so... Peter Munch elected Danish Prime Minister. Oh, good job, dude. This guy just likes the abuse. Petel, Mann, Leo Jorgisch, Emil Eichhorn, and Willy Lehmann. Max Hulls. Okay, I see why we're not doing so great here. Our guys are not really that great at all. Look at that. 
Honestly, like all of you guys. Except for the Marine. Let's do that. It's fine. If we can hold, I'd be I'd I'd like that a lot, so. And get the extra research slot would be very nice. Persian Civil War? Eh, we could have all two, maybe. We do have that extra division still, so. Oh! Ah, Wallonia broke free, huh? Okay, then. Let's see, open party membership. Weekly stability would not be bad. 31%. Um, let's get some more daily Vanguard social support. Oh, we can get away, probably. Oh, there goes Valonia. Goodbye. Hmm, why not? Alright, so maybe you're on retreat now. Come on, hang out. You're looking extraordinarily bad. That good guy, that's so bad. Uh, we need way more guns, we need way more of this, we need way more artillery. You just need a lot of stuff. That's pretty much it. You just need a lot of stuff, man. Persia. How's it looking in Persia? I played Persia too, I think. Yeah, I have. There you go. Have fun, guys. Don't die too hard. So after experimental science, what are we going to do? Bonus electronics. The summer coup war. Nice. Research speed. Call of faction. They have command power increase. Demon as the enemy. Uh, some complexes. Forts. Red Thunder, of course. With the Luftwaffe. Volksmarine. Tetsu. Uh, we'll do this one next. The Heidnischer Socialismus. Once the Germanic people did not worship the gods of Jerusalem, Rome, or Mecca, it had its own gods, and every true per German patriot should worship them. Nice. Why are you here, huh? Nice. See what we can do. Oh. Yeah, let's we'll see what these guys can do. If they can hold, it'd be great. You guys can hold and just kind of not die yet. That'd be great as well. That'd be really swell. Nice. Yeah, experimental science. And another one too. Kind of hard to tell what's been researched and what's not been researched. Maybe my eyes are just bad, and they probably are, but it's a little hard to see. I'm not gonna lie, it's, gonna, it's, a, little, it's a, little, a little hard to see. Land doctrine, yeah. Oh, well, yeah, as soon as I saw them take Tokyo, there's nothing we could have done about that one. That sucks, bro. Oh! Bench of War! Nice! We love it when Spain kills itself. Yay! Nothing like a good old Spanish Civil War. Since we have six research slots, it's fine to do. Um, I guess we're doing this one, huh? Nice. Nice mask. Or face, dude. Oh, Iberian Communes. Huh. I don't know which one we like more. Progressives or Anarchists? Not really sure. Uh, social anarchism. Oh no. Progressive, vanguard, socialist, popular socialists. There's 90% popular socialists here. There's more potential socialists here, so we'll go with this guy probably. And let's send in not tanks, because we're going to run out of tanks. And I'm probably saying this is the wrong group, but in the end, I don't think I'm, just, I'm going to really care too much, I'll be honest. 97 is not too bad, either. Let's see warp. Nice. Basic medium battery is pretty good. Imperial Japan survives for now. Good.
see what happens. And then after this one, we'll probably do uh, conversion of a nation. With a new official conversion of the state to a paganism, we have to think about how to spread this faith against a currently dominant faith, especially Christianity. We can to get wild here, man. How are we doing down here? We're doing okay. They should be alright. Should be able to win there too, so. And again, I said a lot of shoulds in the past. Siegfried Enrici. Cool. Margaret. Tank woman. We love tank women. Go around them if you can. If not, that sucks, but whatever. Ban monotheism. Wow, we lose a lot of weekly stability. Or weekly, yeah. That's a lot of weekly stability gone. Or put Jesus and Jehovah into the pantheon. Hmm. Excavation, huh? Not bad. Uh, go right there and you should be okay. Yay. Oh, we go right there first. There you go. Oh, what the heck. Which one do we want? Do we want to lose weekly stability or weekly stability? Minus five percent, minus five percent. Ban monotheism. Put Jesus and Jehovah into the pantheon. Kirschen und Blashauer. Eh, I think this one sounds like more fun. Ban monotheism. To ensure the growth of the true German religion, we should ban all of those religions. <clears throat> We'll push the paganism out of our beloved country. Also, I do want to let you know that we are on historical, so we'll see what happens with that. So, yeah, we're on historical. I, I want to see how crazy it could get. So, in Red Flood. Which, if you know Red Flood, you know it gets pretty nuts. There's a can. Um, that's not bad either. I'm not using that one for now. There you go. As long as they don't move in, we'll be okay. Or this church is durable. After we've outlawed monotheism, we've managed to crush the foreign places of worship and cement the inevitability of the true German faith. Nice. Hey, hopefully we got that uh, uh, division killed off. Awesome. Oh, oh, I haven't got, oh, see. I haven't got France. I knew they'd do something there. Can we go back up to 100 yet? Yeah, we can. 103 is not bad. Let's see. It ain't much. But it's honest. Close air support. Just literally just sent a few planes in. That's it. Nice. And military police. Maybe get some field hospitals. Maybe we'll see. Can we actually win here? Yeah, maybe. That'd be pretty good. Because there are guys right now, these divisions are not terrible. They're not great, but they're not terrible. I would like to throw some artillery on there, but obviously as you can tell, we don't have a lot of army XP right now. Thank you. Anton Anton succeeds. Cool. Oh, come on, guys. You got this. Nice. Should be able to win here. Maybe. No. Yes. No. Yes. We'll see. I like to go to war economy as well, but obviously can't do that. Yeah, no theorists. We don't have a lot of chief of anybody here. Um, realistically, like we should probably go small tank designer for now, but that kind of sucks. Ship stuff. Oh, do we lose? Oh, I guess we lost, huh? Whatever. And then. Volksding and the Reichsrat to Congress. To represent the true German religion, the Volksding, Volksding should get power. Volksding and the Reichsrat to Congress should, be t should together shape the future of Germany. And Wotan Kult reconstruct the Erminsel. Why not? For den Alvata. Cool. Alright, so, so since we're here, anyways, get some arty. Just flat already for everybody. And since we're here, we got the Ozzelot done already. I'd like to go here. Heavy SPR too. Eh, maybe we'll get this one too. 
Hmm. German tank destroyer. SP artillery. Your assault attack is 42. The 40... Ah, 16 here. I think I'm going to make a really wonky division, maybe. We'll see. Hmm. And this one is anti-air, so maybe we'll use that one. Vespa, maybe? We'll see. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Still doing okay here. As we'll go this way, too. Because we can. Why not? Right? Why not? False conversions. Ah, we love it. We actually won. Salamanca. Oh, we get attacked, too. Nice. Keep it up. Keep it up. Oh, we actually some fuel. Look at that. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Having fuel is very helpful. And reconstruct it. So we can build even faster. Faster, faster, faster. Ah, uh, what do we want? I want more political power. We're going to lose political power, huh? We're going to lose a lot of political power. You get more attack, monthly population, less consumer goods. Praise your money. Plus 25% is not bad, though. Voltan cult? To worship the true German religion is to worship the one god in particular, Voltan. The Alvata, the father of all gods, only by devoting our lives to serving him and his children. We can truly understand the world around us. That's something I almost never do. I actually went with that route, huh? Happy 37, everybody. Uh, we don't really have that many planes to spare, so we can do that one. Take two off. Maybe we'll throw them on the tank divisions. I don't know. Do you, let me know in the comments. Do you ever use, like, SP artillery and stuff like that? I'm thinking about using it a little more often, but we'll see what happens. So. I'm open to using it. Especially for a campaign like this. Where we're gonna need armor. Cool. Fighters. Yeah, heavy bombers are okay. Get more political power. And for den Alvata. Having a German has devoted his life to serving Votan and his children. Only by doing so that true Germanic communism can be achieved. Nice. And we cut these guys in half, which is awesome. Help them out. Help them out. Support equipment like tanks kind of sucks. We need more arty. We need more army XP. Fuel refining. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, armored cars, maybe? I don't know. We're, we're, we're researching things very quickly here. Which, don't get me wrong, I love, but still. You can belt armor scheme? Nice. Now grab some of that, too, because you can. Good hospitals? Logistics. Voten Cult? Voten Alvate. Um, you know, I'll just go praise Germania quickly. Go through all this intent. So, let's go with this one that looks pretty good. Farmers worship Ostaria. I don't know how long this campaign's going to last, but we'll see what happens. Now, you know what? Let's do something else here. Oh, war support. Stability is pretty darn bad, I'm not going to lie. So let's raise our stability if possible. So now we only get 0.62, which sucks, but whatever. Get the guy in here. I'll come in here next. Yay! Yeah, we're doing quite well here. I like this. Good feeling. Yeah, worship Freya eventually. Sailors worship Reynus. Soldiers worship Tyre. Workers worship Velen. Nice. Ah! Beautiful! It's much fun to attack with that one. This one is better to attack, so we can circle and destroy that one too. Ah, yes. Nice. Sailors worship Reynos. Um. Since we're attacking, let's go Tyre first. Tyre. I think that'd be good to do. Wow. Why not? Getting us some good air XP, not enough as much, not as much as I would like, but whatever. Good job, my good it. Wow, twelve divisions! Holy crap, that is insane. Oh, it's so beautiful to see though. 
Nice. That is the exact how I wanted these guys to go to as well. Oh, so good. Oh. Give you some millies too now. We could really use them. There you go. One in millies, one on cities at all times. In a street. Nice. Two, very good. And Velen growth is okay. Yeah, let's get War lovers worship Freya. Push them all over the river, boys and girls under Margaret. Nice. So we have almost full fuel, which is great and all, but I still want more naval XP. It's kind of sad. Just forget. Uh, Weekly War Sports not bad though. Eh, I'll grab that one too because we can. Why not? And we have 8 army XP. Gotta wish we had more daily army XP gain. Bardigos would be nice. And two days left. Freya. And workers worship Velen. Nice. How much more strength does this nation, does this Spanish nation have? They have a really cool flag, though. National front. No, they're out of manpower. Okay, so they're completely out. The only damage we can do to them, they can't really replace. Deck conversions? Cool. Let's get the next one, too. Might as well, right? Zionist revolt. I love the Jewish people. Oh. It was Austria, which I do need to play as Austria sometime. Wrong one. This one. The Reich is led by a certain uh, Dolphus, huh? Dolphus. The Hobbit is published. Good job. Mark Sykes, huh? Alright. Yay, the Sabbath ceasefire. Vila next. I'm just trying to push you to praise your money as fast as possible, so. That's 25%, and that's. That's pretty good too, so. But sailors will worship Renus. Which I'm probably saying that wrong. So if I'm saying that wrong, please let me know. I don't want to say everything wrong, so. Nice, there we go. Good, good, good. And Santonda, so we can get to Bilbao eventually. Nice. I don't want to get encircled myself, so we'll gotta wait a little bit. <coughs> Alright. Can we add anything to here? Because right now we have like no support equipment. Motorized would not be bad. Field hospitals would not be bad. Tanks were out of those two things that I really want to throw on here. Hmm. Maybe we'll save as much army XP as possible right now. There you go. Bill Bow will picture all these guys pretty quickly, so. Well, that was pretty fast. So now these guys should all be starving because the capital's over here, so. A few days left. You know, I started playing this mod. And I'm thinking, when's the last time I played Führerreich? It's been a very long time since I've actually played Führerreich. That mod's still in development. I have no idea. Bacon throw no longer. Nice. Um, yeah, I'll go that one. Why not? I don't know. Hmm. So that was a good question to ask. Is Führerreich still going? Maybe. That's what I wanted to see. Encirclements, baby. That's what we love, love, love. Nice. Um, yep, becoming a mountaineer, which is I do like to see that. An, an organizer. Oh, these guys are vets. I love it. Nice job, guys. These guys are going to die soon anyway, so keep them here. Get a little more organization, and we'll keep pushing out. And we all worship Dona. Yes. That's hurting a lot of a political power game, which is fine for now, but still. You guys actually win there by yourself? Maybe not. I knew that'd be a bit much. They are on mountains too, so, but. Hey, you know what? We might still be able to win. And that'll make me happy. 
Hope it makes you happy too. Um, 37. Planes. You might need some of this later on anyway, so. Hangar space. That's not bad. Nothing there which sucks, but whatever. There you go. Not bad. Make some carriers. We got some battleships already, so that's not too bad. Cool. And we're still winning there. Awesome. Hmm. Getting more stability would be pretty darn nice. Oh, we won! Yay! Well, someone won. Austria's do be looking kind of thick right now. I am getting a little worried about them. Oopsie. And praise Germania. Alright, so we really need more milli, so go down by one. Construction two. Oil processing is nice. Uh, still no one here we can choose, which really sucks. Well, we all need some population soon. Uh, for now, since we have them, go light tanks. That's fine. Our tank divisions, though, are just not that great. Yeah. Since we have SP artillery here, might as well throw that on there. It's going to hurt our organization for quite a bit. This is going to sell them more HP, actually. Quite a bit more soft attack. Because these guys give you, like, six, almost 17 soft attack. And plus 0.4 armor. 0 0.04. 0 0.4 armor. That doesn't really take away from it too much. Nice. These aren't great by any means, or by any stretch of the administration. Administration? Of the nation. Or the mine. Or whatever. But it should work. Praise Germania, my friends. Praise, praise Germania. Now that's over with. Spread the revolution. Um, propaganda. Propaganda is one of the most important things today. We should make sure that our comrades hear about the achievements of socialism. Obviously, I'm not playing this as tightly and as nicely as I probably could, but oh well. Happy 30th, everybody. Hope you're having a great year. Discuss the Bavarian question. Central is plan economy. The idea that Germany can survive with a weak economy that is divided by quarrels between councils is laughable. The only way Germany can fulfill its destiny and bring socialism to all is if we create an economy that can withstand all capitalist attacks. Ban unions, huh? Cool. Hanka movement. Alright, cool. We'll go along with it, why not? Because what else can we do here? The issue of sexuality. The physical or social November revolution, homo, and transsexuality, and all other forms of sexual expression have been decriminalized and more and more pushed into normality by pioneers such as Magnus Hirschfeld. However, similar things could also be observed in multiple centers of futurist ideology. Fiume has always been openly accepting of homosexuals, while French escadronists and Rome even promoted within the army. More and more voices have arisen denouncing sexual depravity. As root cause for futurism and the deterioration of German youth, today the end map faction of the Reichsrat Congress has therefore brought in a call of the recriminalization of sexual deviance for this question. Magnus Hirschfeld has taken or talked in front of the Congress about the mistake to limit the rights of hardworking proletarian German gays and third genders, while Comrade Maslow from the KPD faction announced or denounced the end map D for non Marxist thinking due to the beliefs that not the class, but sexuality shapes the ideology of them. I was also warned that recriminalization would disenfranchise non straight comrades when we push them towards futurism. And then it's only our gay comrades are just as able as any other. Well, we are vanguard socialists, so. Nice. Keep training. Welcome back, Margaret. Or Margaret. Probably Margaret. While the Bayern government is going pretty, on, pretty on well. I was thinking about doing Russia, or even like Bayern government, but we'll see what happens. Which was plan economy. And what are we going to do next? Militarize the factories? Yeah, that's not a bad idea. CKP, all part of the councils. Create the ZPK. We should create a central organ to oversee the economic progress in a glorious republic. It should consist of the most capable intellectual economists or intelligent economists of Germany. The Zentral's Planungskomitee will evaluate the economic situation and make plans accordingly. But. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you tomorrow when we will go ahead and probably end up at war with some of our neighbors, which may or may not include Poland, 
Austrian Reich, or even with avant-garde French. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great rest of your day.